Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Dragon Ball Nation. Now today I'm going to be giving you guys a Budokai 3 HD fight with some remix music and the reason is because we're doing Kid Goku versus, versus, now bear with me on this one. We're actually going to give him the other outfit because why? No, I'll stick with this one. We're going to give him that. Take all his buffs off here. How do I do that again? That's not it. That's not the button. There we go. It's B. He's got three attacks. Which is fine. We don't want to give him any buffs here. Kid Goku versus Demon King Piccolo. Piccolo Diamel. You know, who you prefer. And you're probably wondering, well, Josh, he's not in Budokai 3. He is, actually. Um, you'll see. There he is. It is an extra skin and... Uh, you have to just Google it, or maybe I'll put the password down below or something. There is a password system in the Dragon Arena where you can input a password code. You can get this character skin. There's also one for Trunks, and there's the Halo for Goku. Uh, I feel like maybe not a lot of people know about the King Piccolo skin, but I don't really know, actually. What do we got on you for skills, though? You don't need to... You can't You can't use any fusions. Daimao Power. We're going to give him that just to... Um, Oh boy, does he really need special beam cannon? Well, you see, if Goku has his an ultimate, he's gonna need an ultimate as well. So we're gonna give him those three slots right there. Maybe he's at a slight disadvantage here, but this is gonna be interesting. This is definitely going to be interesting. And of course, what map do we pick? Got Bubbles picking his nose there. Archipelago. Can't go wrong with it. Simple map. But this should be very interesting. King yes, he does recognize him too. But I think he says that even if it's regular Piccolo. And this is CPU versus CPU, by the way. I don't think I mentioned that. <laughs> but this is what that is. I haven't done one of these in a while. I think they're fun to do. So I decided to throw one in just for, you know, I didn't have time to make a really big video today. But King Piccolo's destructive waves are a different, they're like different tints. Some of his attacks are differently tinted, you see. Instead of just being strictly yellow, it's got purple. It's very cool looking. But um, honestly, my money's on Goku for this one just because of the power pole. I think he's going to have this match in the bag. But I could be wrong. The Destructo Disc, or the Destructive Wave, when I say Destructo Disc, the Destructive Wave is pretty powerful in this game, so... So this could be a rough spot for Goku if he gets hit by too many of those. Well, there goes his stamina. And that hits, and that's heavy. That's a powerful hit. Now, I wonder if anyone's going to land an Ultima, actually, in this. And come to think of it, Special Beam Cannon's not even an ultimate, it's a Dragon Rush finisher, I think, so. Well, I didn't have Hell's Own Grenade. <laughs> well, I did actually, you just can't use it unless it fuses with Kami. Um, I don't know, either way, it doesn't seem like King Piccolo really needs any attack besides Destructive Wave, honestly. It does not seem like he needs anything else, they're both fatigued now. But that is just a cool looking skin, isn't it? That is a cool looking skin. They're pretty close though in this match. Piccolo's got a bit more health, but they are pretty close here. Hopefully Goku can land off a Dragon Rush, but it does not look like he's going to be able to do this. Ooh, and we got one. See the power pole, it's got that range. No specials on Goku though. He's not using any specials. We got a defense here, so Goku's going to be taking a big hit. Dishing out almost as much damage as he received, Piccolo does. This could be it. It's not looking good for Goku. He's going to need to land an ultimate. He could have had an ultimate there. Nothing on Piccolo. I think Goku... I, I don't think he's going to manage this whole thing, though. Defending the third round is what I'm seeing here. I'd be surprised if he didn't. 
Yep, there we go. It's that 50-50 shot at the end, so it's kind of hard to, uh, you know, it's, it's anyone's guess at that point. But that put his health down to a better even number. Counters the destructive wave. Wow, with the power pull. I'm telling you, that power pull, do not underestimate it. And that's going to be way too heavy hit. I do not see him recovering from this. He's not playing it smart enough. There's a grab. But this is not looking good. Oh, he has an opportunity, but he's not executing properly. He's only got one chance. Yeah, and I get hit by him. Oh, what? No! <laughs> Both fatigued at the end, and then that happens. That was a very, very strong fight, I must say. I enjoyed that a lot. Hopefully you guys did too. Tomorrow I will be uploading a wish-related kind of topic, you know, relating to the newest episode of Dragon Ball Super. Um, so stay tuned for that. I was going to go up today, but I didn't have time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.